Rain chance in the morning is like almost 20%. So I'd rather have stuff covered up. Just sure. to, and, and, it's, and it's like just about when we get here to start up in the morning. So that could change the ready too. The but, buoys are out. That's the safety. Yes, I saw, them, I saw them uh, put them out uh, this, morning, this afternoon. And as soon as that product arrives tomorrow, that fire code goes up. You okay. know that. You yep. And just the, uh, the only other thing is just remind the uh, public sports guys that the dumps are something. Uh, yeah, 300 and a 9. Yeah, sometime tomorrow. Uh, yeah. Awesome. Good deal. Yeah. Thank you very much, Josh. If you're all done, I have a couple. I never know. If you're all done, ask some questions. Hey, great. Yes, sir. Uh, my name is Ray Rodriguez. What's your name? Justin. Justin Shea. And your position with Gulfport? I'm the cultural facilities event supervisor. And were you just in court the other day? Absolutely. Yes, and sir. what were you uh, in court about? I was subpoenaed uh, for a. Uh, by who? Uh, by the city attorney. Mr. Salzman subpoenaed you to appear. Yes, sir. And what did? What did he want you to appear for? Um, to uh, be a, a, a testimony on uh, a uh, ordinance violation. And what was the ordinance violation uh, recipient's name? Uh, Mr. Uh, Jesse Lee. And so the city attorney advised you to come and subpoenaed you. He subpoenaed me to testify in that trial. Did your boss, Mr. O'Reilly, tell you to show up? Uh, no, it was the, uh, the subpoena, the official action that told me to. So can you tell me what city employees were at this court case? Uh, was was Chief Vincent there? I didn't see the chief there, yes sir. Was uh, Mr. O'Reilly there? Yes sir. Was uh, the, uh, 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 what's the Parks and Recreations Director's name? Uh, we don't have one. What's, uh, what's the position of Fred Metcalf? Was he there? He's Community Development Director. Was he there? Can I get out of the road? Yeah, please. Was Fred Metcalf there? Uh, I didn't see him. Who was there from the Parks and Recreation Department? Uh, myself and uh, Mr. O'Reilly, the city manager. Anybody else? I didn't see anybody. How about police officers? How many police officers were there? Uh, the chief was there. Robert uh, Vincent? Yes, sir. Um, the patrol sergeant Vandenberg was there. I just talked to him today, as a matter of fact. Awesome. And then, no, it wasn't awesome. He hung I'm up on me that. twice. And then uh, there was uh, one of the canine officers... Uh, Janovich? I think so. I know that's his name. Okay. Keep going. Um, Ross, was he there? Uh, he was after. Um, he wasn't in uniform, uh, but he said he had a uh, appearance uh, after the uh, trial that I was at. That was with me. Okay. Officer Ross was there. And do you know that I... I told the judge that Officer Ross lied to a to a, to the judge last time we were there. No. Did you also know that I told the judge I wanted to file a restraining order against Officer Ross? Were you aware of that? Yes, no, sir. Now, how about you explain to me when have you and I ever met? Uh, we passed by a couple times. Specifically, the only first time I ever met you was in that courtroom the other day, and I called you an asshole. Is that right? You did. And who did you tell I called you an asshole? I told the bailiff that the gentleman in the first row uh, said his name was Ray Rodriguez, and he called me uh, an, an asshole. asshole. And what did the bailiff do? He said, "Okay, I'll talk to him." And he did. Okay, now, now, did you issue a trespass warning against me at the Gulfport Casino? I did not. I had a staff member. Do you know that your job. name is on my trespass warning from the Gulfport Casino? Okay. Do you know when the last time I was in the Gulfport Casino was? No. When was it? 2002, I was taking a salsa class with nice. uh, the lady that teaches salsa. That was 2002. Did you enjoy it? Yeah, I learned a lot. My name is Rodriguez. Awesome. You know what? I've lived in this community for 20 years now. And I'm trying to find out why your name is on the trespass warning that was issued to me at the Gulfport Casino that I have never been to in, in 18 years. Sure. So uh, the trespass was from the actual docks area, and from the dock, members, not the casino. The docks behind the casino. So it's not so, part of the casino, or is it part of the docks? The trespass took place on the docks. Um, the day it was issued, or were you called on September second to file to issue a trespass warning against me by Officer Priest? 
let me say that again. Don't answer me. I want you to listen to this clearly. Sure. Were you called by Officer Priest on September 2nd to issue me a trespass warning to, from an incident that occurred two days prior? Uh, I don't remember. You're a lying sack of shit. I would. Sorry. Do you have a phone number that uh, normally uh, Officer Priest can contact you at? Here's my card. No, no. I'm asking you a question. Do you have a phone number that Officer Priest would sure. contact you Absolutely. at? What number is that? Uh, 727-893-1066. Uh, Justin Shea, I'm making a Sunshine Law request under Chapter 119 of the Florida Statutes of all of your phone communications on September 2nd, the day I was arrested by Officer Priest. I want you to write this down. I under okay. You understand, under Sunshine Law, I am making you... September 2nd? September 2nd, 2020, okay. when I was arrested falsely for trespassing okay. at the Gulfport Municipal Marina... I was also issued a trespass from you on the same date. What I am requesting okay. is your phone logs on the entire date from, from September 2nd involving any police officers or any other city employees calling your number directly. Do you okay. understand what I'm asking you? Sure. Where do I send this to? I'll Captain Ray, C-A-P-T-R-A-Y-4-4 at gmail.com. Sorry, say that again. 